Well, hey, Internet, this is Steve at Thousand Year Homes. Welcome aboard. I hope that you're all having a great day. So let's talk about my door behind you. So you see that it's it's looking pretty bad, isn't it? All multicolored. It's just worn out. Everything's flaking and chipping. That's okay. That's all part of the plan. I know, you know, I'm glad that you all have joined me because true visionaries are out here, right? True visionary. So here's the vision for today. So I'm going to go ahead and take off that plaque, uh, drill it out, get the rivets off, keep it, because I'll just use it as a little display later on when I'm done. I am going to paint that whole door black. And the black that I'm going to use is a special rust, rust preservative that converts your FE3 that is a brown rust into FE4, which is bound so tight oxygen can't get through the layer and it, it doesn't rust anymore. Not only am I going to do that, but I'm going to add uh, about a pound, half pound of NASA uh, microspheres that are designed to shed the heat shed the heat so i'll add that to it says i could add it to any paint so i'll add it to the paint and the outside of this i'll paint with a, 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 a energy reflecting paint uh microsphere paint that i've added that you can add to your paint but uh, i'm going to go ahead and try to get that done while it's still in the shade because i'm curious whether or not uh i would like to paint one door black and another one but over here I have another shipping container, and I've decided I'll paint everything with the non-NASA additive first uh, on the inside, and then one of these doors that's in the sun, and then I'll just take my laser and I'll just measure and see who's what. Let's take a look at what products I'm going to use today. All right, let's spend a moment here and talk about these things. So. Uh, I'm not going to give you the prices because I bought them some time ago and I don't care what the price is. It's what I'm using and uh, I'll let you know the results. That matters more to me than the price, which will change. So what I've got here, Thermocells Insulated Paint. Makes any paint insulate. Because if you read through that, those are my NASA microspheres that'll make that cool. NASA spin-off technology. Stay warmer in the winter, cooler in the summer. Oh, I got a Vanna White. Come on over here, Vanna White. My woman showed up. Into that, I could dump that stuff directly into any paint. Well, I have a rust encapsulating black in matte black. This is what I've used to treat the rust on these shipping containers. Now, the type of rust on Core 10 is a rust that just patinas and quits. Um, unless it's exposed to salt water and then it'll go all the way. So anyway, uh, I'm going to add a little bit to that. Leah, Leah will help me decide whether or not we're going to make the inside of the door black. I haven't decided. I noticed you put stuff around the window. That looks really pretty. Yeah, I'm getting there. Yeah. But if we don't like that, I have stuff we bought at what? Uh, the clothes. No, this, oh, is it the, it, it was, the, it was the leftover. That yeah. looks like a gray or a periwinkle. You agree with yeah, that? Yeah, that's pretty. Uh-huh, that that's one. pretty. That might be done. That's my wall at home. Oh, and it's a oh, white? Oh, you got it. No, it's this color. Right? Oh, it's that. So, and then we might have a white. So, but these are the two primary products. So what I'll do is I'll paint one of the doors with it without the NASA cells in it. And then I'll do it with the thermo cells. And we'll check and see uh, what the temperature is. Yeah. Good test. Alrighty, hold on. All right, Leah and I are getting a start here. It's still got a little shade, which we appreciate. So um, I'm going to wire brush everything real quick. And then Leah's finding a regular brush. And we're not going to wash this or anything fancy. We're just going to wire brush it away. And I'm going to shake, the, uh, shake this all up and get it nice and mixed up. And then the way we're going to paint... The inside and outside, wherever there's a recess, I'm going to put in boards. The doors will end up looking like a Spanish mission or a castle portico door that you close with the rosettes and all of that on it. So real quick here, so you can th see what I'm doing. So Leah won't be crazy. She's painting exactly the way I, I told her. So wherever it's out will continue to be an out. Wherever it's in, I'll bevel a board so it fits in and then there'll be rosettes and maybe a strap from place to place a faux strap so this will end up looking like a castle door 
and it'll have wood on it and all of that. So all I need to do is wire brush the, the loose stuff away. And so that's what we're looking at here. We're gonna paint this all black. Once it's black, I can push the door back in, mount it, and including the top. So this will all be black. The bottom will be black. Leah will do everything low. I'll do everything high. And uh, I think we'll put it on stop motion, don't you think, stop motion? So, but the outside will be solid black, and when we get to that, that's when I'll use those uh, spheres, micro spheres, for the insulative effect. And we'll paint these, uh, and one of those, just regular black. Yeah. And then I can measure that, and, and we'll have a baseline. And then I'll repaint it again. Uh, it'll take me a little time, but I guess I don't care. All right, Internet, so over there we painted just one little thing because it's getting late and the sun will be down. We want to get this whole door black um, with the uh, NASA microspheres. And this bag is for one five-gallon pail. So, And I have a five-gallon pail of gray. But we're going to take one-fifth of this and pour it in there. I'm going to shake it up and then we'll paint this door. And then tomorrow we'll do a heat temp test between yeah. that and this, yeah, and yeah. we'll see what's, uh, what's what. So, uh, one-fifth, Leah? Yes. And I'm just going to pour it like that. Yeah. Put my hand. Oh. You think that's one-fifth? I think, yeah, that's one-fifth. Yeah. Want me to hold it? Oh, no, you're right. Okay, right there. Right, right there. That's All what right. I'm thinking. All right, so look how powdery this is. Yes. I would think that this is a respirator kind of a thing, don't you? Is it microspheres? I, the dust blew that way. I wouldn't want it to blow on me. When we, uh, when I put this video up, I'll take the time to get the link and put it on there so y'all yeah. can see the link. So um, let's get that right in there so people can watch it. It was. Uh, not quite diatomaceous earth. It's even, uh, it's definitely, you could tell it's round, right? You mm -hmm. can really tell yeah. that it's round. Reminds me of white sands. It does, but super, oh super, super fine white sand. I have never seen such a thing. Mm -mm. I think it'd be easier if you put the lid on and shook it real hard like this. I think it would help. I think so too. But I'm I'm committed to this. Well, no, that's easy. Just no, put it on. I'm committed to this. It does make it thicker. See right? See it went in. So it went through a phase like chocolate chip cookies. It's still got. I should put a drill on it. Is what I should do. I think it looks good. You're doing great. I think I'm doing all right. It literally just like melted. It did. At first it was like, I'm never going to, and then it went, okay. Okay, give me some. For my, for my paint, sir. You want some paint? How much you think you it's all mixed in? You got more faith than I do. Does that look pretty fit? Mm -hmm. There's a few chunkies, but not bad. Mm -mm. So that wasn't hard to mix in. No. All right. No. So, Internet, I'm going to let this play until I run out of battery juice. Oh, it's already blinking. Mm -hmm. And I guess I'm not going to. Let me get well, a new battery in yeah. here. Would you keep stirring that while I do that? 
think I got all right. We are going to do stop motion while I change the battery on the camera. Mm -hmm. Leah Stir. I'm going to guess a grand total of five minutes with a stick. Mm -hmm. So not a lot. At first it was lumpy, but then when it gave well, up, well, you can be the it, judge and see. We'll find out. Nope. So now I'll uh, put you on stop motion and we'll do the rest of this, internet. Okay, so we're halfway done with the door. Her bottom is done, my top is done. I'm going to go ahead and take readings from the four zones and we'll see if there's a difference right from here. Yep. So there's the top of mine, it says 102. No, nope. <laughs> it's hotter because it's black. 101, 103. Maybe she's on white. It's, uh, well, it'll about 92 for your top, 82 for your bottom. Well, well, you know, the sun is peak right now. 92 bottom. Well, it could be the top's just getting blacked with a lot more energy. Well, let's do this. I'll start here 103, 103, 104, 104, 105. Now I'm in the paint. 104, 103, 102. Okay. Well, maybe, but because we painted it black, we, we reduced the viability. Leah's in the shade, 76, 76, 85, 79, 82. Listen, I don't think that that insulation's enough by, uh, with black. I, I think the black overwhelms the microspheres or it's junk science or we should have done white i mean the space shuttle comes in right and does reject the heat we all recognize that but to see if oh i can add little microspheres of it in paint will that make it cool i don't know tomorrow we'll check this whole door against the test panel and see and then i have a five gallon bucket of gray that will do both of these houses so this year shortly the house will look not like a castaway house it'll it'll be actually but nice now it'll be still wrapped in earth bag but I, I don't want an eyesore for that long it's I bought these February 11th 2022 it's now February about 11th 2022 20th. it's 20th but there we've had these on site for two years two years and I'm finishing up one house now where has the time gone if I had not made a build journal Leah I would think I was lazy. I'm busting butt every day. It's a lot of work for one person to build a house. But uh, if I went through, we cleared the lot, the land, we had to build a drive, I had to refill it. I'm still doing agricultural. I cut all the timbers, I put up all the drywall, I got all the uh, electric uh, at least purchased and around. Um, I had uh, two years of drought where the temperature inside the containers was over 150. I was hitting 160, 162, so I couldn't work on those days, but like five minutes at a time and get out five minutes at a time. So um, anyway, uh, don't think this worked, Leah, based on this. So do you want to use white paint? Next time, 100 uh, where, you're, where you haven't painted, and then in the black, 105. <laughs> It's like those, it, it might be like those things where you add the additive to your gas and you're supposed to get like 30% more miles. Not impressed so far, but we'll let it dry before I, I totally laugh it off. And then I'll look at the cost and see if it was, you know, nothing. Maybe it'll make the paint even weaker. I don't know. We'll find out together. <laughs> I wanted to find a couple of degrees of difference, Leah, it and might. instead it's hotter. <laughs> it might let it dry. Because it's black. Of course black is hotter. <laughs> so can you do it in white? I don't know. Will it matter? Should I bother? Will it make the paint weaker? You know, there's a lot of questions. <laughs> so should we stop it? <laughs> well, it's added to that paint, so no big deal. Alright. <laughs> 
<laughs> I wanted more out of life. I wanted there to be 11 degree difference. Uh, I wanted 11 degrees. That way it would be 11% better. And instead, it's 11 degrees the other way. Well, but maybe after No, it, it wasn't 11. It was four degrees hotter. Uh, well, but that's the, that panel is the panel that we need to test, right? Let me shoot that one real quick. So do you want me to cover this up? Yes, ma'am. Keep working. So 75 is what that black is in the shade. And let me see what this black is in the shade. 88, 87. Oh, okay. I think it worked. I'm going with yes. All right. Well, maybe I said testing was too soon. So looky here. 77. Y'all see the 77 on the container? This is in the shade, 77. This is with the microspheres. Let's go over to the test panel over here. This is in the shade, 86. That, that's more than 11 degrees. Uh, 82, 80, 77. I don't know, Leah. I don't know. I, I think that is salesmanship. I say not stress about it yet. Let's wait till we're done. Well, I'm excited about life, so I'm not stressed. I'm just a little disappointed. But that's why I said don't get disappointed. I wanted yet. a space shuttle. Space okay. shuttle. I wanted to be the space shuttle Let of cooling. It dry. I wanted to be the space shuttle of cooling. Patience. I will say it looks a lot better black. Yeah. I mean, it's like I put on tails, right? What do I want to say? Black tie affair. It's now in a black tie affair. Front door. And that's before I dress it out with cedar. Man, it'll look good once I get the cedar and mesquite on it. Oh, yeah. My brush, you were just going to throw these away. My brush is getting almost unusable. Is yours getting kind of stiff? Uh, not yet. Not yet, huh? Well, I, I was busy running my mouth, right? Instead of working, shooting videos and stuff. But my gloves are getting tacky. Your gloves are getting sticky, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Tacky. Not on the wood, but on the ground. Good girl. No, on the, on the ground. That's alright. We'll teach them fire ants. Yeah, it's a crap. Oh, you of. painted the thing, baby girl. Huh? Yeah, you painted the plaque. The what? The plaque that I we asked were going to paint. I said, do you want me to paint this plaque? Uh, uh, no, I don't want you to paint the plaque. Don't paint the plaque. Said yes, that's why I painted it. I wasn't it. paying attention. Oh, it looks fine. Don't paint the plaque. Well, there's no more plaque. There's a no plaque over on that other side. Don't paint that one. Okay. It gives it class. You are a whirlwind of efficiency. It gives it class. I wanted it. It's still there. No, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'll get some stripper and strip the citrus off. So I think, yeah, I can throw my brush away too, honey. Yeah, I don't say brushes. That's a hard work and I don't want to do that. 
Oh, it's still the top part. You painted this side. I didn't paint the plaque. Oh, the numbers, yeah. But, nah, anyway, the, don't worry about it. I'll just get stripper or something. No, don't worry. Oh, whirlwind. Oh, you said that. I, I said paint everything in this do door. In fact, my direct quote was paint the whole door. Quote, unquote. Internet, go back through, review the video, see if I'm innocent or Leah. Did I tell her to paint the whole door? I heard paint the whole door. I don't know. I heard it. I don't know. I heard it both ways. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What do you think, Internet, though? You like it black so far? We weren't even careful. But, see, it's supposed to look rugged. I want it to look rugged. When it dries, it'll look better, and if we have to do a second coat, we will. Uh-uh. No second coat. Okay. No nothings like that. Remember, cedar will go in there. Okay. We're going to just do that. And I think that that will make it super decorative. Mm -hmm. So internet, as uh, as Leah goes ahead and makes dinner, uh, we're just going to throw these brushes away. I would say that as much painting as I would want to do without a respirator, uh, and you couldn't do use, use this stuff inside. The verdict is out on whether or not the NASA microspheres uh, works for an insulator or not. Since we painted it black, maybe there's a you know we gig the system. Black's going to absorb heat. We don't know. Uh, what I need to do is chase all of the metal bars in any place we missed, as well as the end, and then uh, we'll call that good enough. In between, there'll be cedar that I'll cut, so this will really, really look nice, I think, when we're done. All right, so while Leah makes dinner, let me go ahead, and this is what we use to clean up with, this uh, orange oil, which is super good. It also kills fire ants. Here is a close-up of the Eastwood Rust Encapsulating Plus. That it will turn your uh, rust into, it, it encapsulates it. It's very, very good. It could be used on way more than just shipping container homes. So you can see yourself that it dressed this door up quite a bit. And uh, once I get the uh, florets in here, I want them to be uh, uh, antique faded copper, green copper. And uh, these pockets will be filled with cedar boards cut to match. Oh, that'll look so good. So good. So, so exciting. We painted everything. We weren't too careful about it. We were going again for a, a pioneer crafted wrought iron door, and I think we nailed that. So inside, uh, we're running the fan to kind of push the fumes this way because we're sleeping in the front there. So right there, you can see the door post. We've got it in place. That'll be the window. The two 30-inch um, French doors will be right there. You can see I've got the French doors right there and there. Those will go in this spot. That floor, I'll anchor it when I'm done. So these pockets, we didn't paint those because they'll be planks, right? Big, thick planks that I'll saw up. That'll look amazing. Now let's talk about the, the micro uh, NASA microspheres that are supposed to reject heat maybe I mean you can physically see them on the surface there see the the surface I could feel them and when you pan around the door for example here you could see like some and then you can see not and then over here none so will that reject heat well the verdicts out we've got a mixed bag here we painted it black which is going to absorb heat and maybe we've added the microspheres which will reject heat 
So maybe we've got a net change of nothing. <laughs> So anyway, uh, that's it for the day. Leah's making dinner. So uh, let's go ahead and, and enjoy that. Moer, que es por comida? I feel like an itinerant pe peasant who painted a castle wall. This is looking pretty good here. My mohair didn't tell me, but I could hear her cooking dinner over a, over a fire. If she's ground homemade tortillas, I'd be impressed. All right, this is all done. There's a few misses. I don't care. I think it looks exquisite. Exquisite. And then once I get the cedar beams in there, let's go see what little Leah's up to. Dinner's ready. <gasps> Dinner's ready. I should wash my hands. Look at that. I did one and a half. Well, you were covered in paint. Not only did you... Look, everything a man does, a woman has to do twice as hard. Not only did she paint, but she had to make dinner, too. <laughs> this is Steve and Leah. Say it, Leah. Hi, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye.